all right uh good everyone welcome back to class today i would like to show you guys how to express x in terms of y now especially as in terms of y is just like making s the subject of the formula some plus something like that we have log s y is equals to one now, from the rule of anti-log, if I have log A, B is, B is equal to C, A will be equal to B raised to power C. So, anything you have as the log must be equal to the base raised to power the answer that will be here. So, that's why we're having SY now to be equal to E raised to power 1. That's the rule of anti-log. So, anything raised to power 1, you see that same number. Dividing both sides by Y, divide side by Y, we're going to have X. This number we're going to have e over y. Then we have log 4s to be 10 is equal to 3 plus y. Then this 4s must be equal to this 10 raised to power 3 plus y from the rule of anti log. And you have in this front side must be equal to the base raised to power what you have as the answers here. So then it's divide both sides by 4, we will have s equals to 3 plus, uh, 3 plus y divided by everything divided by 4. That's what I go half in that place. Let's look at one more. We have log s minus y to base e is equals to log e, log 4 to base e plus y square. Now, this x minus y must be equal to e raised to power log. 4 to base e plus y squared from the rules of anti-log anything you have as the log will be equal to the base raised to power the answer you're going to have there is just like that so the next thing y squared can be written as log e raised to the power y square to base e because log e to base e is 1 if you move this y square to the back it will still be log e to base c y square times 1 will still be y square i just want this log and this one this one to have log so that both of them have the same base you said that if you now have log 4 to base e plus log y e raised to the power y square to base e we now pick one of the log and multiply the one pick one of these uh, 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 base and multiply the log so we pick one of these and multiply this times this because plus in log reading means multiplication. So we just pick one of these and multiply this times this. So we will have this. The next, we have e raised to power log of this to be c, in which these b's and this general b's are the same thing. So these b's we cancel out these b's, just almost the same thing with anti log. What we left out will just be the log here. So if I have a raised to power log s to base a, the answer will be x. As far as this base and this base are the same thing, everything here will just cancel out. This will be left out here, which is 4 e raised to power y square. Then moving y to the other side, I'm going to have 4 e raised to power y square plus y. So I'll be the final answer to that.